Jhumpa and Julan are two young girls and they love to play games. So one day their mother suggests that they play this interesting game. She tells them that one of them should be blindfolded and the other can pick different food items and make the blindfolded one taste them and try to guess what kind of food it is. So Julan decided that she'll pick out the food items and Jhumpa would be the one who would be blindfolded. Okay, so then they started the game. So the first food item that Julan chose was sour lemon. So she took a few drops of the lemon on a spoon and she fed them to Jhumpa. And then quickly Jhumpa said it's sour lemon. Next, Julan took a bit of jaggery and then her mother quickly told her, "Shh, crush it first otherwise she'll be able to guess." So then she fed her the jaggery but once again immediately Jhumpa was able to guess that it was jaggery. Next she took some fried fish. But even before she made her sister taste it, Jhumpa was able to guess that it was fried fish. Next, Julan told Jhumpa to close her nose. So this time not only was Jhumpa blindfolded but she also had her nose closed and then she took a bit of cooked karela and then fed it to Jhumpa now Jhumpa tasted it and she said hmm it's a little bit sour salty and also a little bitter but she still couldn't guess what it was so Jhulan gave her another taste but even after another taste she could not figure out what food item it was so next julan gave her some crushed jaggery once again after telling her to wipe her tongue clean with a dry cloth so then she gave it to her but even after tasting the crushed jaggery she still could not guess what it was next julan asked jhumpa to tell her where she tasted the different things that she had given to her to taste so she answered that she could taste the jaggery or the sweetness mainly at the tip of her tongue she said that she could taste saltiness at the sides of her tongue when she was given the lemon she could taste the lemon at the back of the sides of the tongue and finally when she was given the cooked karela she could taste it at the end or the back of the tongue Now that was an interesting game but here's a few questions for you can you tell me why jhumpa was able to guess the fried fish even before she tasted it obviously because she could smell it now another question here for you how about when julan asked her to taste things by holding her nose or closing her nose why was jhumpa not being able to identify the food Well that's because smell often helps you to detect the taste of things. That is why they ask you to close your nose when you're taking medicines which don't taste that good. Now here's one more question. Why is it that Chulan as Jhumpa to wipe her tongue clean with a dry with a cloth to make her tongue dry before tasting the cooked karela? Now that's because in order to taste something you need it to be moist by wetting it with saliva. Now here's the last question. Why is it that Chulan could taste different things in different parts of her tongue? Well, it just so turns out that you taste sweet at the tip of the tongue and taste is actually perceived by things we call taste buds. So sweet taste is felt at the tip of the tongue on the other hand salty taste is present at the sides of the front of the tongue sour is felt or tasted at the back of this part and finally bitter is mainly tasted at the back end of the tongue however recent research actually tells us that all the kinds of taste buds have the ability to taste every other taste there is However, some of the taste buds are more sensitive to particular tastes. So now that you know that you have taste buds on your tongue which can identify different tastes and you know which areas they're present in, 
how about you go ahead and try to experiment with different foods and try to see if you can guess them right.